Hello everyone. I am Julia and I am so glad that you're back for another video. So last time we went um, shopping at the Dane County Humane Society thrift store and found some goodies there for us to resell. We're going to show you what I like that I got. Our first item is this beautiful tablecloth linen. It is square and it is about you can't really tell but it's about 36 inches and it has this beautiful um, edging on it that it was crocheted in and then all of this goes all the way around all of the flowers so it's like a black and pink kind of um, a coral pink I would say and it's very well done and I did not see anywhere that there was any stains or anything on it. Um, it was $2.99 for this. And then we have the next item is a bunch of just various different cards in here. I don't think they're really vintage or anything. But when I uh, send out my items, I like to put in a little thank you card. So that's what I got them for. So they were 99 cents. Kind of open here. And just look through a couple of them. Oh, it's a sympathy card. So that will not go <laughs> in with uh, my item. But there's some like Christmas wishes. Um, so I'll probably send some of those, um, just various ones to stick in. And I don't need them to have the, uh, well, I won't do get well soon either. Um, but I don't need them to have the envelopes and any that I do, uh, keep this cute one here, I'll show you. Um, any of them that I do keep for ourselves. I will, I have plenty of envelopes to use for those. Now this is a little perfume bottle and it has these blue uh, or purplish, maybe was lightly lilac purple um, flowers. I'm not sure what the flowers are, um, but anyhow, but I do know that um, like the stopper can come out. It is glass. And sometimes these can go for pretty well. Now I'm going to gently, I paid 99 cents for it. I'm going to gently peel this back. And it says cologne on it. Uh, it was, I think, two ounces. I'm reading here. <laughs> and it says the Royal Copenhagen Porcelain Manufacturer, Menu Factory? Menu Factory? Hmm, that's interesting. Anyhow, but I know Royal Copenhagen is good, but I thought I saw somewhere on it that it could be a reproduction. So this is part of a set that uh, they had there. And I was really excited about this because these were all half off. So the tag says $6.99. See if I can get that. <laughs> it's backwards. Anyway, it's $6.99. So it was $3.50 or $3.49. I'm not sure which way they did it. Anyhow, for this. Um, I don't see any. Oh, wait. There are marks on here. I'm just going to peel this back a little so that you can see the mark. So, um, I have never seen that before and I just thought it was really interesting. Now this is a vanity set um, that I got 
because I'll show you the rest of it in a little bit. Um, it is, I am not sure. I, it, it seems to be glass. So this is the front there and it has that moriage or moriage, moriage, I don't know how you say it, <laughs> um, relief on it uh, in the gold. Uh, it's all hand, it, hand painted, it looks. And then um, there's like a little flower on the top there and it's just all in really good condition. So I can't wait to figure out, I was trying to search what that uh, maker from that stamp is, but I have not been able to find it yet. So this is the next part of that, and it is a vase, okay? So in the store, it had the stopper to one of the other things, <laughs> inside of here and when I um, looked at it in the store and I kind of you know carefully took it out uh, I realized it did not go in here so it went in the other thing but th these just beautiful blue flowers again with the moriage paint on there or not paint relief <laughs> Um, and that was $6.99, so I paid $3.50. And I am excited about these as well. So this guy here, I'll show you his face. Um, he's painted on the front, not on the back. But on the back it says close-up made in Germany and there seems to be a number on here or something it looks like maybe 1216 but I'm not sure on that so I'll have to look so this I paid it was uh, marked $1.99 but I only paid half price for it as well so 99 cents this is with the other set and this has a stopper that's like a little perfume bottle so it's got that same flower on there so all of these definitely were meant to go together um, so the feel of this is rather interesting it's like um, it's very smooth but it's not satin so it's not like shiny or anything so it's kind of a matte finish but it's very like very smooth almost slippery now on the bottom it is slippery it is like glossy and whatever so I will definitely have to do more digging on those so again that was 350 this is a girl that I got <laughs> but uh, it doesn't match this one, so I'll show you in a little bit the one that matches. So let me show you her up close. She's just like, oh, I'm going to grab my hat here and just, oh, it's such a summery day or something. I don't know. <laughs> she just, I don't know, has this carefree kind of look to her. There's her little foot kicked up in the back. And um, all the little, there's a little rose on there. I did not see any uh, chips or anything on any of the figurines. And that was marked $1.99. And it was half off, so 99 cents. And this, it does have this mark on it. Um, so, to me it looks like an N with the, the thing on top and so I'll have to look up what that means. This is the other perfume bottle. At least that's what I'm calling it. It's kind of large so I don't know. Uh, it has blue flowers 
very pretty and again the stopper now the stopper has a number on it it says 59 everything is backwards to you guys sorry <laughs> um but it was 350 now this one tricked me okay so i have looked this up and i paid a dollar nine nine it is it looks like jadeite right so um but these are actually sold on Amazon and they are to look like jadeite. So these are newer. Um, they, it, still I can make money on it. Um, I think I can probably list it for like around $25. It is um, called the, I believe, Elena Chalice, if, that, if I remember correctly, um, that's the name of it. But it does have that jadeite look to it, and it was just pretty. Here we have the girl to our set. Now, let's see if we can get it to focus in a little bit because it's picking me up. <laughs> there we go. Ain't she precious? Her little bow. All right, and she is also she's painted only on the front and not the back, and she's marked "Made in Germany." And she was also ninety nine cents. So at those prices, I really couldn't, you know, pass it up. I mean, they definitely have some age to them. I don't know anything about those yet, but we will be learning that. Then I have another set of figurines. Now he is just really enjoying life. He's got his fiddle or violin, whatever you want to call it, <laughs> and he is ready to have a grand time. And He's got a big smile, and there is some mark here on the bottom. I think it says NC, maybe, um, I don't know, something. Um, but also, I paid $1.99 for him, so this could possibly be a project piece of someone's. Um, I don't know. I just liked him. And here's his girl. Ah, there we go. And look at her curls on her hair. Now, there is a couple little dings here and there on these. Um, but again, they do just have that look to them that they have some age. Um, so we'll be looking that up. Oh, <laughs> this is actually what I saw in the store. It says, uh, Crease or Christ in Company. It's K R E I S S. And she was also a dollar ninety nine. So this is the package of butterflies. They were ninety nine cents. And these I have um, looked up about that on the back there's a sticker that says uh, lasting products hand painted and these were um, sold by home interiors uh, which is no longer around uh, probably in the 80s and 90s so they are vintage and I just picked them up because I like blue and white. This is, um, I'm not sure if it's a, I think it is a boy and girl, but they're on a little seesaw. Aren't they cute? They're kind of heavy. Um, they've got this definite look to them. They have interesting expressions. 
and on one side it is marked an a n n something maybe center or i don't know i'll have to figure that out a little bit on the other side it says it has a copyright and it says dave something <laughs> okay so i think when i looked him up it was dave grossman it was 2.99 this would be good even like in a garden or something. Now, with the holidays coming up, they had a very um, big holiday display. Like the whole front of their store basically was Christmas. And I saw these and I said, I have to get those. So it is Santa's World. Uh, Christmas ornaments and they are bell shaped and I'm going to show you them but this is the original tag that was on them but even the box a lot of people use the box to display in their um, decorating a lot of times so um, I bought them for $1.99 and the original price on them was $1.38 so, um, at Tops, which I have no idea what Tops is, but on the side it says half dozen, uh, and then it has a number, and it says made in Western Germany. So, those definitely are vintage and um, have a very interesting look to them, and they even have these staples on the corners. So. Now, I'm going to carefully get one out. So, they have a red one. The red they have there's four red ones. And these actually may have come from two different original uh, sets because the top on them are different, but there's four of the red and Two of these gold ones. See how this is much more. Uh, it shows a lot more age on them on these top on this top. So these I think are older than the red ones, but they've got some really pretty um, snowflake and scroll designs on those, and the little gem on there. Okay, and then the last thing that I'm going to show you, which was the very first thing that I picked up in this store, is, um, sorry, I'm trying to close this box and it does not want to close. Okay, and I got that. I'm going to set that back there. And this set is... Um, from home interiors as well. They had a lot of uh, a lot of the figurines in the other video um, were home interiors. I looked up later and I didn't realize um, that they were. But anyway, um, so I may be going back to get some of those. But these have home co on them, and I did not know, but my sister helped inform me that home co and home interior were the same thing who knew anyhow so these are the nativity set it is nine pieces and um, this is joseph with his lantern looking over everybody and i have not seen any um chips or anything on them that I can tell. And here's Mary. And when I looked, when I saw them, I thought, hmm, I better look up those just to see what they might go for. Let me try and show you carefully in the whole box. So they had their original 
uh, foam and you can see all of the pieces there. Now these holes, I don't know if there was something there originally or not. If there was anything, there may have been two other pieces that were like um, animals, but I don't think so. I think this is the complete set. So they have, they all have this number on the bottom that's 5599. And, um, so the comps on these I saw were like around $85 and um, right around there, like quite a few of them. So um, I'll probably list them for, for that. So good deal there. And that concludes our haul video. Uh, thank you for watching. and. Uh, come back again next time. Make sure you hit the subscribe and like button um, and share with everybody our new channel.